All right, it's time for a place, City Skylines. Here we are. City Skylines 2. City Skylines 2, that's right. Here we are. I like how this looks here. It's pretty cool. They need garbage pickup. All right, so let's figure that out. Um, garbage. Yeah, I think I've got two tiles left that I could buy. Um... Where does it make sense to put this darn thing? I just made one over here, but it's already getting full. It's got 21 garbage trucks collecting. <coughs> um, all right, I think I'm gonna have to make one over here despite the pollution situation. Um. What is their pollution? It is I think it's like medium, right? This one's medium. All right, let's try a re recycling center. It has less pollution. Okay. Those people are like, boo, recycling, boo. All right. Let's see. We can maybe not have any more water issues here. <laughs> water is now flowing down this waterfall. All right. So hopefully we're okay now. All right. So let's take care of some of our demand needs, and then All right. we do not have anywhere to put this stuff. Well, it is what it is. Um. So anyway. Let's go. Let's go back to our industrial district. We might progress through large city much faster than we progress through small city or whatever we had before. All right, I know one thing I need to do with garbage piling up everywhere is um <coughs> is uh, I believe another subway like a depot or um, any more high education people. All right. Um, let's see. Maybe we can do this street over here on the other side. The four lane road. Okay, cool. We'll have this go to here and here. Um, doesn't leave us much room to go up and over the train tracks if we want to connect it here. So I may change that before um, before zoning. But we can zone up here first. So we'll go ahead and do that. Okay, so... Let's see here. Let's maybe... All right. Let me try and get this up and over first, and then we'll worry about the rest. So, got this medium road. Go like this. Let's go up two. Yeah. Over, over, back down. There you go. All right. All right, that's cool for now. All right, so we've got this going on. Put this train here. All right, so then let's just go from, oops, from here, we'll come like this and over. 
Technically, we can go there. Perfect. All right. So I'll go ahead and fill in there, there, and there. I know these are okay now to have someone at. All right. And so people can drop off their goods at the cargo train. They can keep coming this way and get on and off this highway. I don't think I need to make another interchange over here. <coughs> um, and we are close to the border. So these goods should be transported pretty darn quickly. Um, so that takes care of that need. All right. Um, let's see. Let's take a quick look at our transportation overview here. All right. So buses. Um, we've got all our bus lines here. They're actually being most of these are actually being used pretty well, which is good. Um, if I were to look at them. This one's got two vehicles. Three vehicles. Nine. Uh, where was I? Seven. All right, I think I could probably re reorganize these a bit to make better use of this. Um, let me first um, figure out exactly where these lines are going. All right, first of all, is this is this place started working yet? Not yet. Oh, they are collecting some. Okay. For some reason, they've only sent out three vehicles so far. Um, so this subway line one. Okay, so the subways definitely need ow, more vehicles. Um, let's see. We're gonna go to our bus lines again. All right, let's see this 3% one. It's sky blue. Okay. Like, nobody's using it, so we're going to down to, like, four buses. Um... And this bus line is basically... Stella Town. Yeah. Oops. Okay. Uh, I thought I hit it in. Maybe I didn't. Town. There we go. All right. Let's see. Apartments to industrial. Bus line five. This orange one. This one is a... No, wait, it should be pink. Don't be pink. This one here, I guess. Which is an... Old Town. So I think this one's train crossing to Central Old Town. Okay. Um. And then seven. Alright, it has pretty good utilization. We'll let it keep nine buses. And this one is. This is, uh, let's see here. Green yards. 
to Evergreen Riverside. Okay, so that'll help me find stuff in the future. This one's being used pretty well, so we'll let it keep its nine vehicles. Um, I wonder if the other one's auto-balanced when I reduced. So train yards, Evergreen has got, it's got a ton. All right. Um, <coughs> so Stella Town, I think I reduced. Let me see if I actually did. All right, ouch. I reduced it to seven. So... Mm-hmm. A lot of people like taking that train. Bye. I mean, that bus uh, it takes them somewhere they need to be. Now if we go Is that to... what, like, all the work is? Uh, it's just a train. All right, so here's my different tram lines. Now you should name it. I should. So I'm doing now, so I can find them in the future. All right, so this you one... the purple one purple train Wait, line. this one has zero trams, and this one has six trams? That's not good. And this one only has one? Well, that's okay. It only has five passengers. Uh, that one has 146 people. Where? Right there. At this one. Oh, yeah, yeah. 10% usage. So let's drop this so we can get tram... Alright, first of all, where is tram line 1? Show me. Tram line 1. Oh. It just goes in a circle. Uh, well, they all have to, because they have to end where they start. No, but like... Oh, no, no. They all look like that. That's to show you where the... So, uh, look, there's one here that has 18. One here that has 30. One here that has 30, one here that has 31, one here that has 17. Alright, so tram line 1 is purple, so it's going kind of like with this one here. This one's going from Industry Row, Industry Row. Land of art and culture. <laughs> Quebon, bon, as they say. And an the train crossing, okay. The infamous Vivaldi shall be our guide. A housing shortage is right, I'm going to drop it by That's right. two cars, vehicles. Good news. So now, if I come to this one, Welcome, Professor. So a housing number two, I should be able to give them some cars now. It's assigned four, but it sh should at least get two now. Are you dropping it? There you go. Here, right here. Assigned vehicles. Two. Okay. Should at least be able to get two. All right. This one is... Train yards to... Train crossing. There's no buses. Yeah, this one doesn't have any. See? Assigned vehicle zero. Because the other one had too many, so I just dropped it. I don't know how long it takes to update, though. Let's see. Thank you, Professor. It is a question of priority. <coughs> Industry in the region is on the rise, and when business is doing well, that floats our boat. There's no sinking this boat, Glenda. Maybe the other one needs to make it back to the yard before it gets reassigned. I'm not sure, because I did just drop it on the other one. This one here. The first one, I told it not to have six anymore. So if I go here... Yeah, I told it to only have four, so I don't know when it goes what down. Happens? Oh good, it dropped one. So now there should be one available for here. Oh, I think he went here, because this one wanted some too. This one didn't have any. Um, Let's see. He's got four now. What was he supposed to have? I think he swallowed up the one that was supposed to go here, maybe. Let me see. Why do they... Tram line three is Industry Row to Old Town. <coughs> Where, what area is that? In crossing, yeah. Okay, to old town. Okay. And then this other one here is a nine mile one. 
It only has one car. Well, we have assigned 15 cars? No, 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 no. Drop that. Seven. Okay. Um, and so this one is... Train crossing... No. Where's this one? It's like really wacky. Hmm. <laughs> that would not be good. Yep. Whoa. So I have 3,000 passengers a month on my tram. And 8,000 on my subways. Oh. I must have it going somewhere important. I don't know. I have to look at the prices. Alright, so all of... So I've got 10 out of 10 possible vehicles for the tram depot. And I could, oh, let me go, let me zoom in and see what my upgrade is here. So if I upgrade it, I can do what? I can have more trams. Well, that's what I want. More trams, please. Thank you. So well, now those should start coming out and fulfilling the lines. Now if I go here, I shouldn't have one with zero anymore. Perfect. That's taken care of. So now... I can go back to normal speed. And pretty sure I'm out of subway cars and I need more subway cars. So let's go to my subway depot. No. Oh. Let's see. All right, still no flooding here, which is good. And no more flooding there, I think. Or am I flooding? Not sure. Shouldn't be, though. All right. So, what's happening here? No, that's okay. All right, someone just called me or something? Oh, okay. <coughs> um, so where the heck is that subway train depot? <coughs> there it is. Nope, that's an elementary school. There it is. All right. We've got 15 out of 15 trains all doing their thing. All right. So we definitely need another one of those. The question is where can I Ah, this would be a good place. Let's buy this square. And we'll buy both of those. Go. Alright, now we gotta wait till we go to the next size city before we can do anything else. All right, these are a whole bunch of houses here. They're wealthy. Not going to like having a subway thing right next to them. All right, what about up here? These are wealthy too, probably. Yep. This thing is noisy, noisy. How about here? What are these people living next to it? Where are they? They're comfortable. These are wretched. They have no money. Poor. Comfortable. Um, doo -doo -doo. let's see. What if I built it just like a little bit of ways? Let's see if they gave me a radius of how loud it is. No, the other game used to do that. Subway yard. Alright, cool. Nobody got upset about that, so that's good. Now let's go ahead and let's do the upgrade for the maintenance. And then, let's see, what was this one? Increased track capacity? Okay. All right. One more maintenance hall on this side? All right. Oopsie, that's the wrong place to put that. Darn it, no. Crap, I don't think there's a way to get rid of it besides deleting this whole thing. Boo. All right, let's try that again. Everyone's like sad now. We thought we were gonna have more subways. You will, you will, don't freak out. Do that again. Alright, 
And now let's connect these train trucks. Well, first let's make the road before we screw up somehow. So this is just a... No one should really be coming here except the workers. So we'll do an alleyway. And it'll come up like this. And... Back. Okay. And now... I do all these tracks. Let's see. Oh, that's a road that it needs. Okay. Fair enough. What right over there? Wait a minute. Let me see. What does it say? Car access. Okay. There we go. All right. So now we've got these tracks here that we need to connect to. So everything on this side is good. So let's see. What if we go thing like this? And you merge with him. You go here. You merge with him. Go here. Uh oh. So, you merge with him. Nope, that was too crazy of an angle. Nope, too part of an angle there. Go further down. Okay. All right, and then by here we should start going underground. Okay back up hmm let's see I guess I've gone a little too far before I merge these guys Let's see, maybe have this one merge into here. All right, those guys are merged. Okay, that one is merged and they're underground over there. I will right, handle the other side in a minute. Let's go underground. And he just has to merge. No, I didn't think that would merge. That would have been too tight of an angle. Let's 
get back to here. Yep. Okay, so that's merged into the system. That should get us more trains. And if we come up here, we've actually got plenty of time before we have to get into an underground. And actually, maybe I'll use the opportunity to make a Pending station up here. To our power grid, the city will be experiencing rolling blackouts. We urge the public to remain calm Let's during see. breaks in service and to follow the guidelines on the city's website on how to plan for these temporary events. This has been a local public service announcement. Local authorities are urging the public to conserve water and reduce the burden on the city during this water shortage. Consider installing a low flush toilet, cut back on watering the lawn, and shower with a friend whenever possible. This has been a local public service announcement. This is Second Moon Radio Classical for the Modern Age. Unlike right. most no. modern music, classical has always been penned Bring this road up. sitting in front of a sheet of blank paper, using only their imagination as guides through a silent audio masterpiece. Now, here we sit, listening at full volume, and our souls are transported. Hmm. But, okay. let us not tarry. On to the next... And, place. let's add a parking spot and here. Our main feature story. The commercial district is booming as the area is attracting more high-end stores, bringing the latest in luxury to our neighborhood. You can now shop for designer shoes while sipping a fancy local Jarva Mate. Or so my wife tells me. That's good for business and good for the community. Thanks, Jim. We'll be back after this. Interesting Oops. news from the city's export division. Sources tell us that our city has more services than we know what to do with. And you know what that means, folks. It means we're not cutting things close enough. Well, no. The point is we're selling it and bringing money into local That's economy. right. You could almost say it's too much of a good thing. Or we could say that we're enjoying a positive trade balance and the economy is booming. More after this. Okay. All right, so that one's there, oh, and it's at 90 feet, so let's come to meet it. Let's see, let's head back this way. Okay. So. All right, so I think what I want to, let's merge these guys first, and then we'll worry about getting up to the right height. So they should all be approaching a place where they can connect. Let's see. Let's cut that one off. Back. There we go, that one kind of merged them on its own. Excellent. Okay. Cool, so now we just gotta get up to 90 feet by the time we meet the other guy.
So about there, maybe like that. Let's see. What the? I thought that one was at 90 feet. There we go. Get rid of that. Okay. So now, back over here at the Overground Subway Station. I might as well give some station services. And on this end, I feel like there's another one in here somewhere. There we go. So there's one right here at Middle Street. Alright, so... Middle Street here, okay. So then, what if we go... I forgot to get my tea. Alright, so I'm probably best off taking this guy underground because we're going to want to make some highway interchanges and so on. Um, so let's go to the way. Drop to ground level. From here, we're going to want to go curvy. The question is, where do we want to connect to? Ah, there's one there. All right, so let's see. Can we go like here, curve in? Perfect. Let's, let's zoom in. And can we... Interconnect there? Cool, and we connected. Awesome. And... And here's a... Here's the train station that's at... Uh, middle... Which serves two lines. Okay. Cool. So we'll... I'll have to... Are getting a little better at this. So this one is in Stella Town. All right, so let's do stop. Do it. Mean him. Stella Town. And back. Okay. And what I want to know is what district is this one here? Not part of a district. Oh, that might have been Samuel Ridge rather than Stella Town. I guess I'll have to see. Let's see. Middle Street, Middle Street. There's Middle Street. So it actually might be the Samuel Ridge. Let me I have to double check that in a second. Let me give this guy a district here.
Okay, so Emerson Croft. I don't like that name at all. But. Alright, let's see. Where is my. Oh, it's actually in Samo Ridge. Okay. So. Scarlet, give me a name for a. Uh, for a district. I love it. Other hills. All right. So the line here will be Heather Hills to Samuel Ridge. <coughs> it's got one vehicle assigned to it. Full cool beams. All right. So let's let me work on. I interchange, drink my tea, and then take a break. <laughs> I think there would definitely be businesses right here by the subway station for sure. As people get off, they can go shopping. <coughs> I mean, it's not a station actually, it's a subway yard, but these people need to work. There's 23 employees here. All right. Um. Let us see. Uh, might as well make some homes here first. And we'll work on the interchange up there. So let's go to medium rooms with a median. Later we got to do some beautification and get some uh, trees on those medians. Oh, nice to see someone on my highway there. I believe in seems City Skylines too. If there's someone there, then it's real. It's not just a simulated car to pretend there's traffic on the highway. I could be wrong, but I think that's how it goes. All right, so residential. Get some people to live here and here and here. And I believe these people would be here, but not on the alleyway there. Uh, we can have some more um, businesses here. And maybe under the highway here. Here. Maybe from here to there. We'll go back to residential. Get some residential in here. <coughs> Alright, so now let's see. So this highway comes from down here where people can get on and off. It loops around. There may or may not ever any be anything here. And Heads up this way. So yeah, we definitely need a place for people to get on and off from here. That There's where the train true. goes in. Cool, 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 cool. Anybody on this train? No passengers. Maybe we'll pick some people up over there. All right. So let's see. We're live, um, and we're getting reports. We've got the cozy highway. Uh, somewhere uh, in the city. Road maintenance services have already been decided. Let's see what makes sense here. Should return to normal, but if you're planning a quick trip out, you might want to wait a little while until everything clears up. If you're in it, you uh, you already know about it. No use reminding you. Meanwhile, uh, expect delays and drive safe. This just in from traffic. If you're thinking about hitting the streets, you can right, expect from delays getting... from the major roads, especially during rush hour. Good getting you know, onto the highway. Seems like everyone is in a hurry to get somewhere fast. It's worth Let's slowing down. A... And if you can plan your trip outside the road. All right, definitely oh, a one-way road. Wait an hour in traffic than I have to start thinking about everything all the time. Besides, if I did that, I'd never get anywhere. Eh, well, it'd be a three lane cuz we're getting onto the highway. So three lanes on. We want to meet up here. And if people are getting off the highway, we will go, go here. Have this come back around this way. All right, and then if people made a mistake, 
they can get back on the highway. I like when that exists. Um, but if they didn't make a mistake, they can continue here. And I think I'm gonna do a roundabout, even though I seem to be getting roundabout crazy, but I think it makes sense because um, that way we don't have to worry too much about the one-wayness of the road. Now, let's go back over here. These people want to get off of the highway. Um, let me see where are we. All right, so we'll do go this way, underneath, and meet up at the traffic circle. I say it, traffic circle. Thank you. All right, and then. We just need to get people onto the highway going in that direction. And I think we'll have that coming out of the traffic circle. Again, giving people a chance if they made a mistake to get back on the highway the way they came. We'll just head this way, under here, and then connecting there. Perfect. Nice. Uh, I think at most that's oh right and so the, wait a minute it got rid of my roundabout again roundabout I said right um so into the roundabout we'll have a medium road perfect and this will come like this now I think these should all be commercial because they're right off the highway. Whoa, we got a one-stop gas station. Heck yeah. Let's put that in. That should definitely be off the highway. Ooh, it's a biggie. What does it give? It gives activeness citywide, well-being. Oh, I love it. All right, let's put it... Put it near the traffic circle. I think that's a logical place for people to get gas. All right, so going back over here, let's do some more zoning. We're getting off the highway like, I'm hungry, I wanna eat something. All right, all right, we'll get there, we'll get there. But I'm hungry now, mommy. All right, all right, we'll stop there. All right, cool. That should eat up a bunch of the commercial demand. Now let's deal with this here and get this zoned. Residential. Kind of feel like there'd probably be apartments like right there. We'll make this, we'll go into a smaller road just to maintain this connection here. And if it if it'll work, I think these would be like a small a series of small apartments right there next to the train lines. Okay, cool. So these things are going up. There's a medical clinic here. Plenty of room for patients. All right, let's, well, I'm not gonna worry about that guy. All right, so now let's come back to a medium road with median. Come like this, can we? Let's see. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. And I think these will be row houses here, maybe. And this side will be apartments. <coughs> Alright, I did make parking over here, didn't I? Let me make sure. I did. I wanted people to be able to park. Yeah, good. So I can park to go get on the metro. Okay. It's got good comfort. Got some employees. All right. That may grow as time goes on. 
Right, we've got only a little bit of commercial demand now, and oh, my happiness is slowly falling. Oh, boo. Mm, got lots of money, though. And 50,000 citizens. Huzzah. All right. Cool, 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 cool. We've got all this. The highway keeps going this way. It keeps going this way. I should probably make another interchange over there somewhere. Now we're at the top of, or north of Samuel Ridge. What might go here? Let's see. I think we can put some housing here. I think it would be logical maybe to have a small road that would kind of put in there. No, not a, not a one way. Two way. Thank you. All right. So that's doing its thing. We can get some more residential moving in here. Perfect. All right. <coughs> grow, city, grow. Still garbage piling up everywhere, but there's nothing I can do about that because of the bug. Hopefully they fix that eventually. All right, we have much, still have a whole bunch of worker demand. Done a ton of upgrades there, which apparently people hated, but hopefully that'll get rid of the garbage. This landfill is just about full. Alright, so we need people, but we need them, bless you, to not breathe in smog. Unfortunately, I don't know why people are so picky about not breathing in smog. Ah, we've got some space, or don't we? I don't know. Nope, that's the farm raising lots and lots of chickens. All right, what do these people need? What are they saying? Not enough customers. Well, perhaps we can get you some more customers. Let's see. Let's go. Up this way. Those didn't connect, did they? They totally did. Not what I wanted at all. Oh wait, here it looks like it's going over. Alright, let me try this again. You know what, since you complain about not enough customers, I'm going to destroy your store. That'll teach you to complain. Alright. <coughs> Some more people live in here. Uh, let's see. This one is safe. Um, here, I'm going to want to make a road first before I start zoning. To my little roundabout there. Okay. This can all be zoned residential. Wonder what kind of vehicle that is. What are you? Road maintenance. I see. Goody for you. We'll live in under the highway there. But not because they're poor, just because they're living under the highway. 
The city has the most amazing healthcare, someone says. What is this here? This is an ambulance. <coughs> On its way to grab a patient. <laughs> Alright, I have oops, finished my tea, so it's time for me to take a break from the game. This has been Eric Plains, City Skylines 2. I will see you next time. Goodbye.